Hello everyone, buddy1707 here. Welcome back here to another little tutorial on Roblox, guys. Today I'm going to be showing you how to import a vehicle over to the software called Blender. Um, Blender is a very good software if you want to export things from Roblox Studio and have them in mesh parts. You can do much more um, with mesh parts in Roblox. You can do vertexes or vortex, whatever you want to call it, etc. Um, and it's a pretty cool, pretty cool thing. So here I've got my um, my suburban. My suburban, yeah, would be like that here in German. Um, I've just actually put a Vela light bar on it um, and spotlight and some other few little things. And this is just going to be my example vehicle today to get over into Blender. So um, basically, first thing that you want to do is over here, when you get your vehicle in, over here, it comes up in your Explorer, which you want to enable by going over to view we've got properties and explorer you want both of these on and so yeah now that so then they're on you want to come over here right click this export selection thing there we go this took a little time to come up on the recording i want to save mine to be my desktop i'm going to name it um suburban save so your Roblox Studio will freeze for a little bit in the process of it exporting, and you, that, so this will come up, um, obviously. So, but boom, that's like that. So I'm actually going to save this base plate, and I'm going to quit out of the studio there. So now we need to come down here. I'm going to open. We need to open Blender. Let me drag this over here. So this is um this is Blender, all right? It's a very Old program, alrighty. Um, so yeah, so now we're in Blender. You want to Shift X to delete this square and hit Enter if you want. It's up to you. But we're gonna come File, Import, Wavefront, OBJ, Desktop. You want to find your um, your vehicle, Suburban OBJ. This is a very good way to um, actually do animations and stuff and um. A lot of the Roblox games like Emergency Response Liberty County, half of their actual stuff was done um, on Blender, some of it. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, you can do many things with Blender, many opportunities with Blender as well. Um, so yeah. Alrighty, so now, where is that ta uh, Suburban, I beg your pardon, not Tahoe. Um, so now what we're going to do, I'm going to bring this over here a bit more, like so. And I'm going to get this. I'm going to grab this arrow and bring it in over here a bit more. We're going to bring it also in a little more, like so. So here we are. This is the um, Suburban, obviously. Um, so I've, I've actually done a few modifications to this one. Um, I've put steelies on it. Um, interior, nothing much, actually. I did put the cage on, the seat in. Um, and same with this. All these lights are new. Um, so, yeah. Um, that's odd. So th some things like that may happen um, on your vehicles if you've got reflectance. If you've got number plates like this, it will have a bit of a spaz. These I'm just gonna remove these for the time being because I actually don't need them for the game for my game um, for at the moment. But I don't want this to be very buggy. So I've got two number plates here, license plates, registration plates, whatever you want to call them. Boom. Alrighty. So. Here you are. So this is my suburban. So basically, if you want to actually change colors of things, don't just don't just do that and delete it, um, because that sort of runs it. Up here, you have this scroll wheel thing. You know, you got over here, you got colors, etc. Because this will show up as um, being able to be see through in the um, in the when it's in blended. So here, what you want to do is you want to um, come here, you want to hit the camera one, what looks to be like a camera, actually, no, you don't, I beg your pardon. You want to come down here to view, all right, this one here, camera, shift F to move, W, A, S, D, mount E and Q to go up and down, shift to go faster, mouse to move around and all that. You can do right click, of course, to zoom in and out, but um, we're not going to do that. So this is the camera, I'm going to set it up. Well, let's go right here. Come back down here, camera, shift F again to move, etc. So that, 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 this is the camera here, and it is facing the suburban. 
Um, now what we're going to do, we're going to hit the earth icon. We're going to hit PAP, standing for paper, ambient occlusion, and environment lighting. That's what I like to do. Then if you come over here, render. My Suburban in Blender. You can't really see through there, but of course, if you sort of do want it to, um, you know, look a bit better, you can just remove the glass if you want. Then we can hit render again. It did look better. So to actually go back to it, if you want to change something, you come over here to this photo little photo icon. You hit 3D view. Same thing. Shift F to move. I'm just going to Control Z that. Like so, render. Parts into Roblox, and or if you want to transform something from Roblox into a mesh part, let me know, comment down below, and um, like this video, please, because then I will know that you want to see that. So here you go. This is your photo. Now, in case you're like, I don't want it to be a gray, I don't want it to be a gray background, man. I want it to be something else. Um, let me see if I can remember how to add a photo in here to it. I don't know if I can, um, because I haven't actually had to use Blender fully in quite some time. Um, mist obviously is just if you want a mist effect on it, I don't like that. Um, there is a way to add photos, but I have sadly forgotten how to. I'm pretty sure it's something to do with layers. Um, yeah. Something, it's something to do with layers. Um, Views. Mm, I can't remember. Sorry, guys. Um. Oh, wait a minute. Never mind. Cancel. Alright. So, like I said, in case you want to change the background color of your render, you can hit these two. These just add, you know, as it saw, as you saw. Top and bottom. I don't really like to do that, but um, in case you want to change the background of it of your um blend, you can um I'm gonna go blue here for example. Then you hit um render, and then the background that is how you rend vehicles and things like that in Blender. So it's basically pretty simple, um, you just have to really get the hang of it. Um, a lot of people, Farming some 19, a lot of people like that actually use Blender for their maps and all that. Um, then they convert it over to a thing called Giant Software, but that's for Farming some 19. So um, yeah. Look at things into Blender. Um, so yeah, thank you everyone so much for watching. If you do want said want to see a tutorial on how to do mesh parts like roblox studio to blend it from for a mesh part then reinsert it into studio please do let me know um we'll probably do an example one on a on this police ramba here um so yeah but guys that's it for this one um thank you so much for watching this tutorial and if you guys did enjoy and you want to see another tutorial please do let me know by smashing